Yes, every year's been an improvement. We've been able to get uh, more workload into our players because uh, we were quite young over the last few drafts, but uh, each year they can tolerate more, so every year's an improvement. No, he's uh, changed his body shape. He's fitter, faster and stronger, and um, now that puts some competition amongst all our key forwards. So he's in the mix and it all comes down to form. It's a tough contest at the moment. Um, we've got Aaron Mullet over from uh, North Melbourne who's uh, trained really well. Cam O'Shea is another. Um, last year um, we saw the emergence of young Tom Williamson. Um, Kieran Burns come off a knee, so this, uh, there's a lot competing, so it'll all come down to form and, uh, and see where that ends up. Well, I think many know he's got a huge engine. We always think master your craft first and then move into some other positions. So Charlie's still learning to play that key forward role and uh, little hits on ball this year. So I think you'll see him in there from time to time. Yeah, we're a club that tries to allow our players to play to their strengths. We're not just going to pick up what another club does and copy it. So we're really open-minded and the game evolves and changes. So um, let's see how that unfolds. But we're, we're quietly confident that we've got some marking power up forward now. Uh, we don't want to rely on one person. In time, we'd like to have uh, multiple goal scorers. That's what successful teams do. But... Um, it'll be great to see if some of our midfielders pushing forward like uh, Cripper and Murph can hit the scoreboard as well as our, our forwards that are currently there. But um, there's some, some excitement with young Jared Garlett and, and Pickett, two Indigenous boys that might be able to hit the scoreboard as well. Yeah, well uh, now uh, an early draft pick, which doesn't mean a lot once you get through the door, you've got to work hard. and. That's what Lockie's done. Um, he's an elite runner. Um, he can already run at uh, AFL um, levels, so um, we're really hopeful he can play some games, but his form will dictate that, like with all our, our youngsters. Yeah, we think that, uh, you know, with, with being early picks and um, hard work, that they're going to be part of our future growth. And Harry's had an in interrupted time over the past few years, but he's looking fit, fast, and strong. And, I think most of us were excited in those few games he played, so we'd like to see him feature this year. Um, Paddy was our early pick and uh, he's got real explosiveness out of stoppages. So uh, again, form dictates this, but we like how he can, um, how he can run and spread from a stoppage. It feels like every year with the turnover of the list, um, we're investing in our youth, but now hopefully we don't have such a turnover of, of, uh, of players this year and it can settle and this year it's about putting standards in place that are going to hold true in finals and hold our players to account but more importantly just build synergy and chemistry, have a group settle and play together over a period of time. They're our main goals.